This is my redesigned smart dustbin system. The sensor detects a user presence from 50 cm range and opens up the lid for disposal of waste. Once the waste bin is filled up, the system will automatically send out an SMS to the owner. Open it. Let me see. Open it here. Let me show you how I built this project. First, I assembled the components that I will be using for this build. Securing the cut-out board in place, I started my soldering. Having the discrete components in place, I soldered the same 800 module which I will use for SMS. This is the final look of the assembly. Next, I got the bucket that I'm going to be using for the waste bin. I mapped out the lid for the part that I'm going to be using in opening and closing the bin. Completing that, I used my drill tool to cut out the lid into two equal halves. I cut out further the lid frame just as you are going to see the reasons for that soon. Having the lid just the way I want, I apply a spray paint to make it look nice and neat. Now I completed the programming of the microcontroller just as I have the sensor tested on a breadboard before mounting onto the paveboard. The code for this project you will get all together with the schematic diagram on the video description. This is now the look of the assembly just as you can see the SIM module blinking while it's searching out for network. The green color on the LED indicates objects found in 50 cm range of the sensor, while the blue color indicates no detection or a user close to the sensor and finally the red color means that the dustbin is filled up. The infrared sensor measures the level of waste in the bin just as I will show you how I mounted it. Starting off the coupling, I drilled out hole to screw the hinges onto the lid. Next, I mounted the ultrasonic sensor in place just as I have it in front of the waste bin. Setting up all the rest of the components onto the lid, the project is now ready for test. Open it. Let me see. Open it here. As you can see, the system responded via the SMS prompt onto my phone. Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and share this project with your friends.